Hello everybody. Welcome. Okay, Esther, you're here. Yay. Okay, here we go. Thank you everybody for joining and welcome to our first free Monday Friday. Um, as you know, or you may not know, our scholarships open um, February 1st. So we are here to tell you a little bit more about our scholarships. Um, and to help us with that, we have our scholarship expert and Director of Research and Innovation, Esther. So let me add her. Let me see here. There you go. Hi. Hi. Oh, my hair looking a mess. <laughs> You look lovely as always. Oh, oh. Back. I'm too close. Um, I didn't introduce myself. I hope everybody knows who I am. Um, my name is Rosa Ankel, and I'm social media manager for Ship National. And then, as I mentioned, we have Esther Gonzalez with um, Research Generation, our director, our beautiful directora. How are you, Esther? I am great. How is that doing? Good. Um, okay, we can get started. We have quite a few people few people on. Um, hi, Dinah. Thank you for joining. Let's see. As everybody knows, you can drop all your questions in the chat and we'll address them as we go through this. This is going to be a quick info session um, and it's on scholarships. My laptop just turned off. <laughs> oh, no. oh, there we go. Okay, so our first question, Esther, for you is, what is our scholarship program? Yeah, so our um, scholarship program awards over 200 applicants. Um, we are able to fundraise and award over $1 million in scholarships for um, Hispanic or Latino uh, students, um, SHIP members that are pursuing a degree in STEM. Awesome. So most of our members. <laughs> if you are a member, if you... 0.75 GPA and if you are pursuing anything from a bachelor's degree all the way through a doctoral degree then you uh, qualify so if we have high school students as mm -hmm. members they do not qualify or do we have scholarships for if high school students? you are a senior student now and you'll be a freshman student next year you do awesome and same applies for community college members who are applying to college the following year all community college uh, students qualify. Awesome, perfect. Um, and then you said anybody can apply who's a member. How about if you are a Dreamer or a DACA student? Yes, so um, our SHIP um, scholarships definitely support um, Dreamers, undocumented students, um, Regardless of your citizenship status, you can apply um, as long as you're attending a, in, an academic institution in the U.S. or Puerto Rico. Um, and what else do I have on that? There are some opportunities that require uh, citizenship, but that will be explicitly listed in the requirements of the scholarship. Awesome. And then we currently, you said we have over 200 mm -hmm. Um do you expect more to be added as we are going through our scholarship season, essentially? That is always our goal. Um, <laughs> and we do have um, opportunities to come up throughout the year. Um, it's not a guarantee how many we will have, but that's what we work every day to do. Awesome. Um, my next question is, so I'm applying and we have a lot of members. What are my chances of getting a scholarship? Um, so our award rate is about 10%. Um, that is actually better than most scholarships. I know that sounds kind of low, but that's actually really good. Um, but that is what really motivates us to raise more money to be able to award more students. And do you have a range of like, um, I'm sure it's listed on each scholarship, but is there $500 scholarships up to like $10,000 scholarships or are they single year scholarships? How does it work? Um, so the minimum amount for any one scholarship is $1,000. And we have scholarships that go all the way up to $25,000 a year. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Um, my next question was, um, what should be submitted with the scholarship application? 
So there's quite um, a few materials. They're all listed online, but basically you need to have your resume ready, have somebody in mind for a letter of recommendation, and there are a couple of essays to fill out. Um, but what I will say is that uh, we have a webinar series, our scholarship webinar series that outlines exactly what you need um, and when you'll need the materials. Um, so, um, Register for those. Um, and the awesome thing about our scholarship is that while there's so many um, scholarship opportunities, um, we have a common application. So the main part of your application you do once, and then you just do supplemental pieces for each additional opportunity. And then those, obviously, they'll be notified if they need to submit those additional information, correct? Yes. Okay. Um, you mentioned the webinars, and I wanted to, I looked up the dates. So our first one is February 7th at 5 p.m. Pacific, um, and that is essentially the process on how to apply for scholarships, right? Mm -hmm. um, our second webinar is Building an Amazing Resume. So you'll get resources, I'm assuming, and direction on how to build your resume, and that's February 15th at 5 p.m. Pacific. Mm -hmm. And our third webinar is Telling Your Story Through a Compelling Essay, um, Wednesday, February 23rd. And then the last one is uh, in March 3rd. Yes, March 3rd. Wow, what a letter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so also at 5 p.m. Pacific, and I'll tell you all about how to write your recommendation, um, all about your recommendation letters. And I think we yeah. had a question. Yeah, Jen has a question. Can you donate more money for scholarships? Absolutely. Um, so if you go onto our homepage, there's a donate button. Um, and when you select the purpose of your donation, there's an opportunity to select our general scholarship fund or also um, two of our additional funds, which are our Heaven um, Cuesta Scholarship Fund that specifically supports our ship Tina's. Um, and our Ship Pride Scholarship Fund, which supports our LGBTQ plus uh, community ship. And then that, um, in our link in our bio, you can also um, go to that donation page directly. Yes. Um, I think Jen's also, can you name it after me? Jen, no, if you donate a significant amount of money, I think we can work something out for you, Jen. <laughs> yeah, so, um, on five thousand uh, dollar contribution you can have a name scholarship um but you you can choose when you make a contribution of any amount to provide your your name um as the donor or you can donate anonymously awesome any more questions before we wrap this up i'm trying to swipe Oh, hard eyes for 25000 Yes, I know. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> so um, if there's no questions, we will actually go through the process in greater detail. All the logistics, everything that you need to know, um, you we will be covering on our introduction webinar uh, this coming week. And we do, um, in response to Brianne's question, uh, we mentioned a little earlier, we have scholarships um, if you are currently a graduating high school senior all the way through the doctoral level, we have scholarships um, for for everyone that's pursuing a STEM degree um, regardless of level, and that does include community college members. Yes, awesome. Thank you for asking, Brianne. Okay, I think we're good. I hope this helped. As we said, it was a quick info session. The greater details will be in the webinars and we'll have another free Monday, Friday uh, next Friday, <laughs> where we'll discuss Here's from somebody who's gone through the process next week. Yeah. So. so we'll get definitely insider from a recipient, and we're so excited. Um, and as always, if you have questions, you can still reach out to us. I believe there's an email for scholarships. Yep, I'll type it in the chat now. Perfect. And also, if you're part of our text message messaging service, or if you're not part of our text messaging service, you must sign up. You can find the information on our website, on our newsletters, um, and we'll be able to give you like um, direct, quick 
announcements through our mess text messaging service. And then as always, we post here on social media. Thank you everybody who joined. I hope this was beneficial to you. We can't wait to see you on Tuesday for the webinar. And then again next Friday for our next Free Money Friday. Thank you, Esther. Thanks. Everyone have a great weekend. Feliz fin. Bye. Bye.